And this morning's Health Watch doctors say more and more people are becoming nearsighted, and now OHSU is trying to help manage the condition that threatens people's vision. Fox News' Drew Reeves is in studio with more on how they're doing that. So, Drew, what exactly is causing this issue? Yeah, so OHSU says that nearsightedness is increasing because more people are spending time inside and in front of screens. In fact, they say it's expected that half of the world's population will be nearsighted by 2050. So nearsightedness is when people can see objects up close, but in the distance, things look look blurry. It's also called myopia. To help with the rising number of people with the condition, last year the OHSU KCI Institute established the Myopia Management Program. Through the program, they help children get prescription glasses and special contacts or eye drops that help with their vision. And donations have allowed them to also provide the service to low-income patients for free. Ten-year-old Melody Redfield is receiving care through OHSU's Myopia Management Program. She's now using a pair of contact lenses designed to slow the progression of her nearsightedness. It was pretty frustrating. Um, definitely during the whiteboard, like like when like they were showing math problems at school, um, I had to like get out of my chair and walk up to see. It helps a lot because I don't have to get on my chair, walk up, and be like, okay, this that, go back, write down, next, okay, this that. She had a, a choir concert this past weekend and. I'm very used to her not being able to see us in the crowd. So when she looked right at us and waved, that was that was touched. That was cool. Yeah, so doctors say there are a couple of contributing factors to this growth of nearsightedness, as I mentioned. The, uh, but the first is that nearsighted people are more likely to have nearsighted children, so they say the genetics plays a role. And then, as I mentioned, kids are spending more time indoors. And studies show kids who are outside are less likely to be nearsighted. Doctors say it's an important issue to tackle too because nearsightedness can cause all kinds of serious vision issues, including glaucoma or myopic macular degeneration. Reporting live in studio, Drew Reeves, Good Day, Oregon.